Bill, do you generally vote on election day? No, I, I don't believe in voting. I think voting is a drag because um, I think the whole electoral process is, is a total fraud. I think that the American people are faced with voting for a bunch of um, very... Well, they're, they're, they're phony. They're, they're set up. They've got to be actors in a certain way. There's certain things they're supposed to say. There's certain bounds they can't go beyond. And it's all very close. And I, I think it's all a game uh, to uh, keep so where people can keep deluding themselves where they're choosing leaders, you know, while the power structure remains the same. And I, there's no real point for voting for anybody unless there's somebody that's really groovy and there's not too many of them. I, I wouldn't be against voting if there was something to vote for, like if, if there was a, a leeway, if there was candidates with different... Uh, really different views, basic different views, and they were all given equal airtime, and they didn't have to have a million dollars before they started, uh, it might be worth voting for somebody, because then somebody would say, hey, vote for me, and, uh, and we'll, uh, we'll get, uh, you know, we'll absolutely get out of Vietnam, and we'll uh, vote for me, and we'll, uh, do, do, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll, na we'll nationalize television, <laughs> and, make, and, uh, and, you know, have educational color television, and prime time, and NBC, and put some groovy shows on, and help straighten out the American people from their bonanza syndrome, you know. <laughs> Anything like that might be groovy to vote for.